There's a woman that goes to the hospital because she got an appointment for a surgery to get done. So she goes in the surgery room. She gets back here, lays down on the bed. They give her anesthesia, and off to sleep she goes. Well, while she's asleep, she had a near-death experience. She's seen God. So she's seen God. She started asking the question, God, am I dead? Am I time up on earth? This and that. And God says, oh, no, no, no. He said, no. He said, uh, you still got 45 years left on earth. She said, oh, really? Boy, she was relieved. Well, after her and God got through talking, next thing you know, she woke up in her bed in the hospital room. She's looking around thinking, wow, I, I still am living. God said I have 45 years to live. So she's thinking now. She asked that doctor. She says, doctor, while I'm here, is it possible to get liposuction? The doctor says, yeah. He, she says, what about tummy tuck? You sure can. She said, what about facelift? Sure can. Nose job? Sure can. He said, we can take care of any needs you want done. We can take care of it right here while you're here. What about breast implants? We got you. She said, I want to get all that done. The doctor says, okay, we'll take care of it. While she's getting all that done, in the meantime, she had somebody come in there and color her hair and whiten her teeth. Boy, she had the whole works done. Boy, she had everything done. She figured she got 45 years left on her. She's going to make the best of it and look her best, boy. When the doctor finally got done with that last surgery. She gets up out of bed, walks out of the hospital. No sooner as she starts crossing the road, out of nowhere, bam, a bus hits her. Kills her dead on the spot. She goes up to heaven. Boy, she's furious at this point. She looks around, she sees God, she says, God, what's going on here? You just told me I had 45 years to live. Why am I dead? Why, why didn't you pull me out of the pathway of that bus, God? God said, heck, I didn't recognize you. 